we are going to take a look at the second standard in operations and algebraic thinking. This standard is titled, We Can Solve Word Problems That Call for Addition of Three Whole Numbers Whose Sum is Less Than or Equal to 20. We're going to take a look at this story problem written in blue, and we are going to continue to use the steps in red on the left-hand side to solve story problems. The problem is, I went to the pet store and bought new pets for the classroom. I bought three turtles, six fish, and five hermit crabs. How many pets did I buy in all? Step one was read. I've read my problem. I will go to step two, think. I know they want to know how many they bought in all. In all is an addition math vocabulary term, so I know this is going to be an addition problem. What I also notice is that instead of having just two add-ins, they're asking me to add three add-ins, three turtles, six fish, and five hermit crabs. So I am ready for step three, write the equation. Three plus six plus five equals and I don't know my sum yet because I need to go to step four. Draw a picture. I tell the students, you can just draw circles to represent the pictures in a story. If you want to draw the pictures of the animals, that's fine. But a little time saver is just to draw little circles to represent the animals. So here are my three turtles. Six fish. And I like to keep the groups a little separate. And five hermit crabs. So each of these groups represents an add-end. The three turtles, the six fish, and the five hermit crabs. Now I'm ready to solve and write. How many pets did I buy in all? Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Now I solved, I'm ready to write. I always go back to the initial question in the story problem. How many pets did I buy in all? I bought 14 pets in all. And that is how you solve a word problem that calls for three whole numbers. Thank you.